Well, hello there. We were on quite the adventure in the last little last autumn run. And uh, it didn't work out, guys. I hate to say it. I am not perfect at all, <laughs> as you probably know. And uh, we're going to try this again, taking the things that we learned and making different choices, working with different people, signing different laws, prioritizing differently. The name of the game, different things. Not all of the things, because some things worked, but different things as much as we possibly uh, can. So let's begin. Uh, let's just get everybody grabbing stuff. I'll even put people on the uh, the coal for now. And uh, let's sign some laws. Okay. First thing we're going to look at this time. What is it going to be? I might actually go into... I might actually go into here and do sustain life instead of radical treatment. Then I can go into overcrowding. That just buys me a little bit of extra space, which I'm not against. Um... Yeah, that's fine. That's cool. That's all well and good. That's great. Let's get a uh, workshop up and running. Looks like I can kind of tuck some right in there, which is nice. We'll take it. And I need a little bit more wood to get that connected. Let's do that. And I'll tell you what, I will actually snag some of this wood. Okay. Should I go double workshop? I don't think so. I think maybe that's a bit of a trap. I want to make sure that maybe on the second day we can build a cookhouse. I think that would be nice. Uh, we do need some tents. And I'm going to build them down here this time. So that uh, we have a little bit more space to play with. Up here I had like the chapel situation. It was a little bit, a little toit. But whatever. Not a big deal. Okay, people are happy to be here. Little do they know this is about to get ugly. It's about to get ugly. Yep. Let's go uh, first things first. We're going to go faster gathering here. Because who doesn't want to gather faster? Duh. And uh, I don't know if this will help or not. But I feel as if... If I... Uh, is there a better way to connect this? I'll do it from here so it's clean. Um, maybe if they have housing for nighttime, they won't get sick, potentially. Because we had few people get sick the last time. Now this time, I last time I said let them be, I'll stop them here. I can play with my discontent a little bit. I don't know if that actually leads to any sort of potential issues or not. Whoops. But, um, you know, let's just err on the side of, of caution. Okay. So we do have, obviously, not everybody housed here, but we've got some. And I'm okay with that. I'm gonna go overcrowding. They're not gonna like that right away, but whatever. If we get through the night here without anybody sick... Okay. Well, there's two. It's not that bad. Um, Could I commit to giving shelter to everyone? Yeah, I will. I will commit to that. That's fine. But I am going to need to build a medical post today, and I'm going to build a food thing today. And we need to build sawmills. Let's build our cookhouse. And I'll need a medical post at what, 20? 25. I should know this. All right. In here, we'll go sawmill. And then we'll throw up a uh, medical post next. And then we'll work on shelter. This will not happen tonight, I don't think. Nope, definitely won't. But we can treat people. And uh, tomorrow we can probably finish that. Alright, what's next? Uh, care house. Uh, let's go chapel, actually. One thing that I didn't do as well in the last scenario, for sure, is making sure I'm blasting off chapel stuff, basically on or off cooldown, however you want to look at that, right? Okay. I do have some workers at the coal. That's fine. Some more illnesses. 
because housing. Reality check. This is basically saying that um, motivation is going to drop every morning. Which is exciting to hear, definitely. Definitely exciting times. It's not adjacent. I'll place them in their predefined little spots. I need one more house today. Okay, sick. So this now, can free that up. Don't need anything until we have... Um, until we have other stuff happening. Let's put that there. Another workshop. And then I'm going to need... What is it? 10 to build a, a sawmill. Let's get this up and running. Something in there is fine. New laws. Let's do evening service. I can place a chapel back here. I think that's cool. Um, everyone's going to have shelter. That's exciting times. And then research. Get me to 10. Nice. Very nice. Uh, docks. Okay, cool. Yeah, uh, maybe I shouldn't have done docks. Maybe I should have done the uh, scavenging thing to get some people out there. But at the same time, that also eats 15 workers. So, yeah, okay. We're getting a little buildup of coal. And one thing I would like to have is, you know, um, I would like to have surplus workers available or surplus um, resources available. Because we're going to need to generate... We're going to need coal for some stuff, right? Like, I'm going to need it at some point once the generator is built. So, I think having some, some surpluses there would be excellent. Um, the docks, the downside of this... Yeah, no, I probably should... I probably should have gone into Forger's Quarters. I'm going to abort that and go Forger's. I don't know if you get all the resources back from aborting. I feel like you might. Because uh, I'm looking at our rations here and I'm like, yeah, we're going to have some problems <laughs> pretty quickly if I don't go and find some stuff. We have a skeptic. Discontent will fall. So the science says only fools doubt it. We want motivation to rise big time. We can deal with discontent, especially temporary stuff. Not a problem at all. Uh, I feel like today that steel's going to go. That steel's probably going to go. And should I build an extra sawmill? Is that is that aggressive? I know this will tear down some, but I'm okay with it. All right. Now I can build. Whoops, that was a weird click. Forger quarters. Let's do this. And we will get people sent out. Let's do docks. I did say, like, well, we're going to lose our workers, which is, yeah, Folks, true. But it's got to happen. Okay. Let's go to the reindeer tracks, baby. Put the rest there for some wood. Um, so steel now. We have one left, which means the docks, I got to get up and running and produce some steel. Uh, let's get our chapel in here. Hitting that rightmost house. I can't put this in a really nice spot that's going to hit them all, so whatever. It's fine, we'll put it there. Nice amount of wood coming in. Love to see it. Motivation's rising. Good. New law. Okay, what should we do here? I could open up... I could sign Gruel just to, like, get us... Yeah, frick. I don't know. <laughs> I actually don't know. Let's go public house. Let's just go public house. And then I, I can even build that right away. Just throw it in here somewhere. That would have been nice to fit there, but it's all good. It's all good. Let's put it up here. Maybe get that built before morning. Um, could probably build another workshop. Get up, people. Work 
Wood, steel, yeah, everything's gone. Okay, reindeer tracks, empty. Hunting grounds or nesting? Now, I don't know if these are randomized, if I should be, like, remembering the names of these places to try to prioritize, like, where the gathering spots are. Discontent will rise and motivation will fall. Mistakenly lodged in a tent full of workers. I'm going to say, yeah, fine, discontent can go up. We don't want motivation dropping at all. Um, I have a bunch of free workers now. And what I'm going to do is get another sawmill. Uh, not there. Do I want another sawmill? No, because I'm going to build docks soon. And we'll employ them there. Another thing uh, with the public house, and I should just look this up, and I probably will, but um, this will reduce discontent. I do feel like if I staff more people here, I'll reduce more discontent. That I'm not certain of, though, okay? And so you guys have probably told me before, but I've mentioned a few times that I'm recording these, like, hard, like, in advance. I'm, a, I'm straight up addicted to the game, so that's on me. But uh, some of your advice, you might be wondering, like, hey, why isn't he doing this? Or why does he take so long to implement this? It's uh, because I'm crazy and I'm addicted to this game. and I'm having such a super time um, doing it. So, yeah. Anyways, docks are coming in. I got to build them. I got to get stuff going. And I only have four days left to do it. Why don't I build another workshop? Great question. Why don't I build another workshop? Well, I'll tell you what. I will. Okay? I will. This hospital is doing nothing. I've got workers. I could build another... Um... Oh, yeah. I could build another... Um... Sawmill, but like I said, I think that these guys, like, I need to staff people at these docks. So it's gonna be it's gonna be some work there. We've we've researched almost everything in this top level. Maybe I should just snag uh, profiles. Or if I go here, then I can get reloading stations. I feel like maybe I feel like these need steam cores, so I'll just take this for now. And I might have to do um, some gathering posts for a while. As a kind of in-between. Please have food there. Oh, deadly. Okay, sick. That's great. Set up camp. So we're going to bring rations back in 10 hours. I love that. This place is up and running. We're going to put workers and we're going to say steel. Yep, yeah, we're going to say steel. And then, uh, yeah, I think we'll just go a gathering post. I'll wait until they start making piles so I can place it correctly. Uh, House of Pleasure. Let's go bare knuckle bouts. This will cause some injuries, but it'll keep discontent low. And as long as people don't go to starving today, that feels pretty good. I will put max workers here for tomorrow. Not a huge deal. This is going to start making piles. Come on, get Telegraphs. Oh, yeah, sick. We definitely want that up and running, like, ASAP. Telegraph station. Let's go. Um, we'll put it here. Actually. Yeah, okay. I mean, this is all dead space anyway, so I should probably build roads out there and then put them in behind. All right, there we go. We have a pile of goodies. Let's put a gathering post here. As close as I possibly can. I don't know... Yeah, I feel like these red spots will be where they go. So I can probably... Get away with this. Alright, so now... I can start ordering stuff. Right off the bat... I've got 40... Now, that's a lot of workers, and I think I'm just going to take that. I'm just going to take a batch of workers. Now, that's a lot of them, and I don't have a lot of empty um, housing, so I'm going to actually need to build three houses here, and that's fine. That's t It's totally fine.
I'll run up here and we can connect behind at some point. Yeah, sweet. Let's do uh, 20 food rations for an evening service. Absolutely. And now we go drawing boards and we have the trees to do it. This is awesome. Okay. I feel like our start here is great so far. This is a great start. Um, we are not done yet, clearly. We are not done. So we need to start gathering stuff by the docks to clear this, but um, we should. Why are they going to build, guys? What the frick? What's their freaking problem? Trying to set up society, give people places to live. How dare they? How dare they? This food should sustain us for a while. Um, yeah, it should. And if people aren't getting sick, that's cool, because all my engineers can just research the hell out of stuff. All right, cool. So, now, here's one thing we do want to be paying attention to, is our milestone dates. Um, and I want to stay ahead of that. So I'm going to need eight of these little doodads. Eight little doohickeys. Should have been building this probably much earlier. But whatever. Here I am. Building it now. It says I'm two days ahead of schedule. All right. I need uh, eight of these. These cost 25 wood. There's some workers. Love that. And now what do I want? More foragers, maybe? Reloading. Yeah, so reloading costs a steam core. Sawmill upgrade, I don't hate. Forger carts, not bad. I need 20. 20 wood. I think I'll go more foragers. And then, uh, where's my beacon? Here. So, I think... I'm, I don't know, but I think every time this comes in, I just order more stuff. Whether it's one uh, steam core, uh, five engineers, or ten or eleven workers, I just do it. Right? Because it's, it's going to go on cooldown, takes a day to bring them in, like, I don't see any reason why I should wait. Okay. What's next? House of Pleasure. Actually, I don't mind that, because it would increase motivation. So, there we go. So, that's producing... That's bringing in 3.3 uh, per hour. If I had more workers, I could probably put an extra gathering post there. Okay, supply ships. Engineer received a letter from relatives in India. They explain a sudden frost. Censor it or don't. I think if you don't, I think if you censor, it's going to come back to bite you. I could be wrong, but I feel like that would that would be the case. Uh, I'm going to put one worker in here now. And uh, the rest, well, I'll tell you what. Let's build another gathering post. I hope that that is counting as hitting that. Uh oh. Safety concerns. Im pass a law improving safety. Okay, so we have safety levels now. Now, one thing I didn't do early was extended shifts or two shifts. I did not get into that. Safety procedures is good because you can reduce it, but uh, efficiency drops by 25%. Then you have short shift, and I'm not sure what's better. It raises workplace safety. Same as this. Um... I have to wait to sign it in anyways. What are the hours that they're working? 8 to 18. And I'm just not sure if I 
I'm not sure mathematically what's better. So maybe I'll have to pause and do a bit of math once we can unlock something there. Folks, enough work for today. Do people build multiple of these, I wonder? Probably if you had a shh buttload of extra workers, right? Yeah, this is nothing in range. Frick! That's what I was worried about. Okay. Okay, tell you what. Um, that's going to go. Hate to say it. We're going to build that back here. So I wasted some resources there, but it's all good. It's all good. Everything's fine. It's all cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Now, people are sick, so I'm going to have to shut down that and go here. And then workers there. So I've got steel coming in. I've got two sawmills running. Um, we have rations coming in that is feeding people. Discontent's fine. Motivation's fine. Um, we are apparently three days ahead of schedule. I'm building this stuff as fast as I possibly can. I need four of those. These guys are going to be a bit unhappy because of the overcrowding, but that'll fall off today. Okay, more foragers is done. Now, let me go forager carts, and we're going to speed them up. Okay, and I'm going to send or build another one of these. But that is going to reduce my workforce. But again, the pros are that we're out there exploring. Okay, so there's 11 more workers. And I could do 11 more. Sure. Why not? Now, where am I going to pull people from? We actually are done here. So let's shut that off. And I'll make a team. And we go... Small waterfall. Whoops. Speed demons. Okay, sick. Uh, we do need housing, and we can start building the sh shaft structure. So let's do that. I've got 16 people. Not a lot, but that is a start. Okay? It's a start. Now, I suppose what I could do is pull off of the steel a bit. Put them in here. Is that dangerous? So, when those big events happen and we have those setbacks, I should probably try my best to avoid that. I will drop the public house to one for this. And... What I'm, what I'm doing is... Trying to make it so that we're we're hitting these priorities ahead of schedule. Because last time, that was not the case. So if it requires me turning off one of these for a bit, so be it. Shift's over. Stow your tools. And like, yeah, we're not making stuff, but we need to get these going. Two people homeless? Oh, that'll be fixed. Okay, so now, Book of Laws, labor. So if I go to extended shifts in any facility to 14 hours. Okay, so I'm gonna, let's do some, let's do some math here. I'll, let me pause and I'll, I'll do some math and I'll walk you through what I come up with. Okay, so uh, I'm looking at the options. I actually think I'm gonna go two shifts here because I can extend to 24 hours. Now, I don't know how the impact is gonna be. It says you it needs double manpower. Uh, it's gonna cause discontent. Discontent rises slightly. Um, same thing here though, like if you go, like they're gonna, it's gonna cause discontent in either way. So I think I'm just gonna go two shifts and 
Now I can ex now the work shift can extend to 24 hours. Which is cool. Oh, you can even put them at the docks. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. So if I go uh, uh, here, 24 hours. So I can put 20 workers there. Okay. So, I mean, look. It's not going to be as efficient right now. Oh, same thing here. Workshops. Yeah, cool. Cookhouse, why not? So I can run these at 24. Same thing here. They allow me to staff more workers. What's the downside? I just get more space for more people to work and it works around the clock. Seems like a no-brainer, but there's probably something I'm missing. Ooh, crap. Oh, crap. They're going to be pissed. That's going to cause an issue. I, I, I forgot about signing a law that they wanted for, for that. Okay, well, uh, they're not going to love it. Okay? They're not going to love it. But it's fine. Okay, so now we're speedy boys out there. Hmm... I am going to need the machine shop. I'm going to need cores for the reloading station. So let's maybe go fishing harbor, I guess. I could get a core at this next one. But yeah, there's no sense in me researching that until I can make it happen. Right? Um... Yeah, damn. So I probably will hit a... A bad situation here. Toxic gases. Workplace safety falls by a level. Yeah, we have a situation. Yeah. Okay, well, um... Look. <laughs> Both of these are, are deadly. So does that... I don't know if that matters now. I'm basically splitting my workforce there, right? So, putting on the 24 hours, the benefit is, like, you get trickle in at nighttime and stuff, which I think is great. But it's really only much more beneficial if you're maxing it out with people. Like, I should maybe do something like that? I don't know if that matters. I don't know. Okay, 11 people. Sick. Um, that's great. That's great. What do I do with them? What do I need? I guess I just go here. Yeah, my bad. Frick. That sucks. Ah, that's unfortunate. But I do, I do need an option to improve safety there. So I think um, safety procedures could be interesting. Let's sign that. Let's go here and, and click this. So it's dangerous. And I can keep it at 24 hours. And that seems fine. Right? Seems fine. I think what I'm going to do is pull from there. Where's all my workers, man? This is what happens when you send them out. So I got 20 there on steel, essentially. I'm going to reduce that by a margin. I'm going to try to get more in there. This place just work regular hours, I guess, at 5. That's fine. Uh, here we'll get a core and some workers. Okay. Fishing Harbor is done. I don't think this is a bad thing to set up. But maybe I don't need it right now. Oh, hunting grounds just got depleted, so actually, <laughs> I might. 
I might. Okay, let's go nesting place for you. To a fishing harbor way up there. And we reached, we reached the Wapids. We reached them. I always found that um, speech impediment like endearing. I kind of love, I love the, I love that. I think it's cute. Okay, now all of a sudden people are getting very sick. Oh, toxic gases. Right. Right. Okay. So that's a bit of a problem. It's a bit of a problem. Now, the last time we were building this thing, we had, uh, we had, like, a big catastrophic event. Catastrophic? That's the right word? Yeah. We're four hours ahead of schedule. That is dope. Let's go collapsed mine here. Mountain Lake. Good fishing spot. Beautiful. Okay, nice. Nice. Now, I don't have any workers to put there. Really. Let me pull off of there for a bit until this gets a little bit more depleted. The 24-hour shifts really opens up my availability quite a bit. Um, maybe I could dismantle one of these, get some stuff back. Not a bad idea. Suspicious. Oh, am I not researching right now? Stop being paranoid, intercept letters. This is the German sounding, yeah. I'm gonna say stop being paranoid. Let's go into, uh, I'm gonna need this. Let's go reloading station for now. And let's go into accident risk, reduce at all workplaces, discontent will rise permanently. You know what, that's fine, okay? Let's reduce the risk of accidents. Now, this place is deadly because of the gases. And if I put this down to regular working hours, I don't get any improvement. So let's keep it going, I guess. Let me build another medical post here so that we can stay on top of that. Collapse mine, nothing. Lost crates, go. No accidents, please. Okay, two workers in a steam core. And it's not the sexiest drop off of all time. Let's order another steam core, because I'm going to need one to build this next building. I'm going to need one for the docks. But I think my gut tells me I probably should just be spamming workers, if I'm being honest. Four days ahead of schedule. I love seeing that, dude. That's exciting. Lost crates. All right. Okay. Take the crates or it's not ours to take. I think we're going to take them again. I think we take those. This is... this. We got to survive, man. Oh, frick. Okay. Uh, well... So, it seems like the only way to tackle this would be to have a lower safety level. And... Or a higher safety level, I guess. And I'd have to do that by taking shorter shifts instead of the extended one. Fair enough. I can't let people die. That'll be too big of a setback. So we just got to take the 40% the setback. I mean, it sucks, but what are you going to do? I'm still three days ahead of schedule, which is awesome. That's fantastic news. I'm not producing anything that I need for the next one, unfortunately, but like, clearly we have a bit of an issue. So I'm going to build this, we're going to get rid of this, and we're going to get rid of this. New laws. Let's go into... 
Coordinating work, both shifts can reduce downtime and cut employment by a quarter. Ah, uh, that's interesting. Two shifts causes more discontent. Discontent will rise slightly. Let's do that, though. It seems like we can max out our efficiency at a lower amount. If that's how I'm interpreting this correctly. That's the key question. Let's go machine shop, because I'm going to need that. I'll put a couple extra workers here. I actually don't need the extended shifts there. I'll just put two workers there. This place... That's fine. The construction strike is on strike. What? I think that should say construction site. Uh, yeah. All right. Better working conditions. Three days to pass short shift. 75 rations. Okay. I'll, three days to pass short shift. But at least that's resolved. Right? Okay, now, this is exciting. I'm going to choose the engineers this time. I have to build the factory inspectorate. New labor laws will favor engineers. So the factory inspectorate uh, will improve safety of up to three most dangerous workplaces. Dude, that's... Wait, that's actually sick. That is actually sick. What do I need? 60 wood? Bad omen. Construction stops for four hours or shoo it away. Discontent's pretty high. I'm gonna say let's take the four hour hit. Okay, look at this. So the convoy is heading for winter home, long way from here. Return the crates or keep. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm gonna keep it. There, I, I imagine that there's something that would like get me a benefit or something, but whatever. I'm gonna keep that. Okay, so what's happening here? This is an operative. Let's put the extra workers that we have there. Okay. We have some people getting food there. I just, I need workers now, like, so aggressively. This is a bit of an annoyance. I'll use these four hours to get people, like, doing other things, I guess. And now I really need... I need to get into engineers and stuff. Factory inspectorate. This is cool. Destroying resources is less cool. <laughs> wow. It's so big. It's going to destroy resources somewhere. Unless I go here. Okay, this is actually fine. And it's connected, which is nice. Food-wise, I'm happy to say we're good. Um, I'm not stoked about the illness situation. We're going to clear this place out really quick, though. Okay, so now, let's go back into, well, I'm trying to think if I need workers or engineers. I need workers. I need workers. Send it. And these guys came back with those goodies that we just got. Fine. Let's go lake full of fish. That's got to be one of those spots, right? Max that out. Max that out. Good. One worker at the thing is fine. I gotta get these illnesses handled. I need engineers here. Frick. Let's say I drop this and put one in. Motivation rises. So how does this building work? Factory inspector would improve safety of up to three with full staff of inspectors, workplaces, with the lowest base safety level. So the three lowest will get buffed. And as they put more in here, we'll get more places. Okay. I do feel like um, if I go down to this, 
doesn't help me at all. And this is taking it down to here. I don't know if... I don't know if I can, uh... Like, if I put more engineers in there... Let's see. Does it improve it to a higher level? I think it it sounds like it's only going to improve it to... Um, or it's just going to add more places that are being buffed by it. That's what it seems like. Where am I at here? Three days ahead of schedule? Okay. Man, I just have so many freaking people sick, though. This is not good. Okay, really... I'm really going to be behind if I have to keep healing people. Machine shop is done. So I am going to need that. I'm short the wood that it's requiring. What would I want next? Oh, you know what? Medical post. Upgrades. It's not sexy, but it's got to happen. Let's just staff two there and just try to get patients in. Ooh, discontent. What did that just say? Strike risk is increased by high discontent. Okay, that's fine. Okay, that's less fine. Because we resolved it before. We're now at harmful. So this is good. So now... Let me run this with higher efficiency. And this is something I need to pay more attention to. Is the changes here. So gas is going to go up, and then we're going to have to make some adjustments to that. Okay, but that gives us a whole bunch of extra efficiency. Cool. Come on, man. 24 hours. Just don't blow anything up. Seems pretty easy. And actually, why do I have a bunch of workers? What, what just happened? Why did I have a bunch of workers doing nothing? Hmm, weird. Come on. Lake full of fish. Yep. All right, cool. So let's set that up. And then I'll tell you what. Uh, we're going to build... We're going to build some docks. And we're going to take these workers out of that dock for now. And we'll uh, put them over somewhere else. Okay, more workers. Go here. Actually, let's max this. Go, go, go. Now I'm going to need that machine shop in 30 wood. Okay, we are officially online. Before laying the foundations, we'll support the massive bulk of the generator. You have to send your workers deep below the ground level and install the powerful tower pumps there. Okay. I can actually do that because of those steam exchangers that we got. So that's an option. But in order to build the pressure valves, I actually don't need the machine shop for that because I had the steel composites. I still need to build it, which is fine. Yeah, this is fine. Okay. 25 wood there. I could go optimize materials. That might be interesting, but I really got to get my wood production back online. That's taken a pretty massive hit here. This place just... What? Oh, it's fine. Pretty high strike chance. Unfortunately. Let's run it at that. Abandoned site. Congratulations on completing your first milestone. Site 107 was scrapped. We'll double our efforts. Yeah, cool. You want to send me, like, a bunch of uh, workers? That would be real nice. Just saying. Just saying. 
I'll tell you what. Let's get a couple engineers per batch here. Try to keep a little bit of a, a balance. And... Uh, Let's go wood there. Uh, the sicknesses are sort of being handled. I'll try and balance these out a little bit better. Okay, so let's get some of these going. My raw food is insane. Let me uh, max this out just to convert a whole bunch here. And then I better pick like something that's going to help. Overseers will visit workplaces to motivate employees and enforce compliance of proper procedures. This raises discontent, but also increases motivation, but also the strike risk. And it raises efficiency by 15. Internal promotion, factory inspectorate, promotes five workers to engineers. Costs 50 wood and 50 steel. Oh, interesting. That's kind of neat. I'm going to take short shift for right now, though. I'm going to take short shift because I want to be balancing this as best I can. Okay. 25% out of a 24-hour shift I feel is good if we're at harmful. Discontent has been lowered a little bit. It still says it's high, so... I mean, it is what it is. Factory Inspector at bonus... I have great news. Uh, the company sent us a shipment of fine tobacco. It's a rare delight in these times. Wouldn't it be nice to share it with the workers? Strike risk will fall or keep it for the engineer and efficiency will rise. Keep it for the engineers because strike risk is pretty good. Rumble in the deep. Produce safety equipment. Yes, definitely. Okay, sick. So now I can turn this off. Run that at harmful. Yeah, hell yeah, dudes. Three days ahead of sketch. This is wood. We have double rations coming in. Let's try to get as many on this as we can while still getting some wood going. These guys are waiting, but not going to wait for long. Oh, it's because I'm full. It's because I have too much food. All right, let's go drafting. Oh, I need wood. God damn. Okay. Dra okay, I need five more wood. Five more wood, guys. Oh, God. For real? <laughs> okay. There we go. Okay, so here... We're getting the bonus from that. That's actually... That's really quite nice. That is really solid. Four days ahead of schedule. That makes me super happy. What I'm what I'm struggling with right now is um, wood. Clearly, that's what I'm struggling with. Uh, but if I get a reloading station on this, that would be nice. Way more efficient. Keep that on 24 hours. And now let's get. More workers.
What now? Motivation is going to fall more every morning. Good. That's that's exactly exactly what I was hoping for. Workplace will be 10% more efficient during short shifts. Cause little discontent, discontent will rise. Right, that's an option. Or, oh, I've got to be blasting sermons, you guys. Sermons. Care house, let's get that going. And I can just build, oh, I can't even, can't even build one. Okay. Maybe I can just say F the sawmills at this point and just get wood from there from a higher efficiency um, standpoint. You know? I think that's all right. What did I just sign in? Oh, the care house. Yeah, let's build one. I need 25 wood. I need houses, guys. God damn. Please be a good thing. Did something bad happen? Yeah, something bad happened. Okay, we have some options though. <sighs> Workplace must be safe. Damn it. So maybe I shouldn't be pushing it because these setbacks really suck. Generator won't be able to power more than a few heat zones. Workers will evacuate. Construction stops. Generator will have normal power. All workers will die. Send safety equipment. Many workers will be gravely injured. The construction will stop for three hours. Okay, well, I hate to say it, but that's what I got to do. Now, there is a high strike chance here. Let's do that, just to kind of keep things chill. And then... Man, I actually have too much food, if you can believe that. Okay. Let me actually get some... Resource depots. I can put resource depots inside there. That's interesting. Successful evacuation. Good. Generator can achieve full heating power. Some people are injured. Could be way worse. Supervision. The old methods are not good enough. We've seen enough cases of wastefulness and inefficiency to convince us all employees would benefit from direct supervision by engineers. If you put us in charge, motivation will rise and efficiency with it. Overseers. Okay. Okay, engineers. You wouldn't be lying to me, though, would you? No. Not these guys. I don't think they would. Would they? I don't think they would. Definitely not. Okay, now this. More workers on it. We're running short shifts. <laughs> like, uh... Is this place not providing me any benefit right now? Up to three workplaces with the lowest base safety level. Oh, it's because it's closed. Well, that makes a lot of sense. Doesn't it? Care house, motivation, good. Motivation, here's one thing we have not... Oh yeah, and I said the chapel. Damn it. The chapel. Blast it, dudes. <laughs> Damn. Okay, well that sucks. Uh, what am I going to need? My next delivery, I'm going to need a steam core for that extra building that I need to make. So, cool. Now, last time we did prosthesis shipments, 
And I actually ordered a bunch of prosthesis one time instead of steam cores. So for that reason, that reason alone, I'm going to take medical repatriation. And I can ship people out. Consuming less food. And all that. Residents of the carols will be sent back to London, reducing the need for housing and food. Don't let us go. What? The company will stop paying me. I never had to beg for my life. Oh, I'm sending. Okay, tier two tech. Good. Um. Upgraded docks is sick, actually. Optimized materials, though, for those structural profiles. Yes, let's do that, because we're going to need more. And then, can I empty one of these now? I'm going to. This place also does not need this many workers. Go back to here. There's 10. Okay. So I said I need a, a steam core. I'll get two workers here. Where's my progress? I'm, I'm ahead of sketch, man. I am ahead of sketch. I love that for us. I do. I do love that. Okay, tell you what. I think we're going to take a bit of a break here. Uh, when we return, we'll carry on. Oh, this is neat. Minus 25% from safety procedures, but 10% from the tobacco. Right, okay. Well, it's unhealthy. Toxic gases, base safety. Gonna rise tomorrow. But if I turn this off, efficiency is gonna go up. But it's only, it's not harmful. Like, it is what it is. And then we'll max that. Okay, yeah. I'm, I'm, we're in a much better position. We're actually ahead of schedule, which is crazy. But I do need the... Um, I do need the steam core. Not a huge priority, but it is coming in because I can get these other things done without that building. Um, I do need to start ramping up our wood or our, uh, sorry, structural profile production. But I actually have optimized materials, so I'll wait for that and then we'll uh, kick it into gear. And I think our next few batches are going to just be like mega amounts of workers and stuff. And... Um, See what we can do. Oh, I have to pass overseers as well. And I'm not going to be able to. Damn it. I forgot about that. What does overseers even do? Oh, yeah, the efficiency in nearby buildings. Huh. That strike risk is kind of interesting. Okay, we'll have to see. Uh, but we're gonna hit, we're gonna take a motivation and discontent hit there, unfortunately. And uh, yeah, there's not much that I can do about it. So wish me luck. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.